chair. Save your knees. Right, so look at this. What have we got? Some OMI. I think OMI is still later. It's been uh, blowing the fuse now and again. We'll get the cover off and see. Okay, so we've got a looks like a Tecumseh Unite Hermetic compressor. I think it's probably uh, it's probably it's quite old. It's got a metal badge on the top, not a sticky label. It's probably an R22. Uh, what is it? We've got a big one cap, one cap, and a cap for the fan. Got a pressure switch. It's probably low pressure. Yeah, it goes into the compressor there, doesn't it? I think that's probably a high pressure port. Got some taps down there with service ports. So that dryer is pretty rusty. Christ, that is bad. Look at that. Yeah, it's dry there. Yeah. So we probably want to test, make sure there's no power. Okay, that's all, that's all crispy. Right, that doesn't burn. 35, let's see what that test says. Should be a 30. 35, should be a 35. And it's got a bump in the bottom there, so maybe that kind of it's not level. So okay, got this one which is a 35 plus or minus 5, 450 volts. This one, 35 plus or minus 10. That's only 370 volts, so the voltage is a bit low. And the only other one I've got this huge one here, which is upgraded at the 600 volts. So I'll have to see if we can fit that in there somehow. I have got these screw in clips that you can put a cable tie in, so I might have to put two of them in. Okay, new capacitor in there. Put it in properly if it works. Um, let's get a poker. Let's see. It goes round. It pulls in all right. I think that would be the run current. So let's see what happens. Huh. Not a lot. I think we left it running. Well, there she be. Might be too warm down the cellar, not too cold. Well, let's go see. Okay, got the cover off. We've got got power. I think we haven't got any power on the signal wire, so it's probably too cold in the cell. So, okay, let's give it up. See what happens. Oh dear! I think we have took the power out somewhere. Hmm. Maybe that's dead. Let's turn that off. I can smell something. Hmm. Don't look good. Should have put a mega on there. I just did it with a multimeter and it tested fine, but there's not enough volts, so maybe they've 
killed it with that being deaf. Hmm. Let's go and see. That doesn't look very good, does it? That doesn't look very good there. Not, not touching. Uh, anyway, yeah, it's triple power, so we're gonna. Well, we should confirm we've got a good earth first. Which we have. One, so we're on the copper. We're on the copper. That is our start winding. Dead sure. It's not a lot of point testing the other one because you found one short, but I always do. That is dead short. And two, we've got the run winding, which it could be feeding back in if something else is connected to it. So we'll, we'll pop the terminals off. Here. the one we, we haven't tested. That was shown 400 and so I think. Yeah, so that's okay. So that's... The compressor's gone, so... It's probably... That's old, it's probably R22. Oh, twenty two, so must be must be twenty two years old at least. Probably older. Probably thirty years old. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. The price up for a new one. Uh, the pipes go round the back. And off and on there, we're under some stairs. There you go, off around the corner. Okay, let's get outside of that fence, I think. That's that cave as well, so it just goes down where they drop the barrels in. switch I think it's I think it's off of that breaker should we try and see yes it is it's off about 32 uh, so yeah it's screwed to the back wall so my brick wall there point work comes out here it looks like a half inch half inch three eighths this comes up and runs the length off the roof Goes round the corner and out. So we'll measure that up. Yeah, the train's almost good. It's just it's obviously not run while this has been set here. Okay, well that's the indoor mechanical stack cap for the fan. Uh, incoming power. It's probably that one. And the outgoing is that four core, five core, whatever it's four core, isn't it? Live neutral and switch live and on earth. It's like a uh, fire alarm cable, isn't it? I think. So this is an IMI Air Commission Limited 224 volt serial number. Input cooling 0.7, output heating 3.17, C insulation guide R22. Can't see a model number. 